The Women and Gender Studies Clothesline Project is a visual display that bears witness and attempts to break the silence surrounding violence against women and girls. T-shirts are decorated to represent a particular woman's or girl's experience by the survivor herself or by someone who cares about her or cares about the issue. The T-shirts are hung on a clothesline for viewing. What's your experience been like with the Coastline Project? Like, um, what does it mean to you? What does it mean to me? Yeah. Um, I think it's um, it's been very good. Like, I, I hear a lot of positive feedback from mm -hmm. students on campus. And uh, I actually videotaped last year people walking around and looking at the t-shirts. Mm -hmm. And just watching people's reactions when they find a t-shirt that I think really speaks to them or maybe somebody they know or a situation that's happened and uh, really seeing the interconnectedness and, yeah. you know, of humankind when that happens has been, has been really interesting. Yeah. Um, so I, th I think it's just a great way to educate people about the issue of domestic violence and, and uh, intimate partner violence. Mm -hmm. um, so that's really, yeah, I think that's about it. senior sociology major and a mass media minor. Uh, to my knowledge, the Clothesline Project is uh, basically about, uh, I guess, awareness against violence against women. And uh, I have made a t-shirt before. I made one a couple years back for uh, my mother, who was uh, abused as a child, her and her sister. And um, it's, it's a really good cause. You see they got the, the shirts hanging out, and you hear stories from all over the world, coincidentally. And so it's a really good project. The t-shirts on the clothesline were made by VSU students, faculty, staff, and residents from the Valdosta community. The clothesline is displayed each year in October during Domestic Violence Awareness Month. Participants walk through the rows of clothesline to bear witness to these tragedies. The project focuses on providing healing for survivors of violence, educating the public about violence, and preventing violence. 